Hi, I want to show unit testing with integration testing in this one pass project and I will be unit test this support controller. This project is running and it is the open ticket table. And if I click view details, you can see. And this is a customer profile page. It's working. Okay. Uh, I just applied asynchronous programming. This is good for performance and applied repository pattern. Uh, this is the prerequisite for this unit test and ap also applied unit of work pattern so that we don't need to write redundant code and applied ninject as a res dependency resolver okay and n unit i already used as a test runner you need this extension to be installed in your computer so that you can test and you it this test adapter I have installed okay here is my support controller test I will test this action method um, okay let's test this here I am creating support fake table support ticket and here I am creating customer profile video table this is uh, why I am creating because uh, in unit testing we cannot use real database uh, unit tested should be done inside memory that's the reason that's the reason why I am using repository pattern and unit of work pattern and dependency resolver ok let's see let's debug this test Uh, we are. I am testing this action method. Uh, this is this signature is calling database, and here directly calling. Uh, we need to mock this and this. First, mock this and this is the mocking code this is just presenting that uh, the same signature uh, this is the condition the predicate this part is the predicate and this part is for a string a string and the other portion is null if any object it will call back this let's get that by running and another 
mock-up is this condition predicate this portion predicate this will call back let's see we are going this action method it will jump here and let's debug it matched this signature that's why it came here and it will came to this actually here we are getting this logic filter from here this portion is in here and this portion we are getting from here and the logic is applied to this table through this function this is common generic function this table has is closed false false True. Then we will we should get two row. Okay. Now it's done for customer profile B2. We are getting this filter the exact same logic this portion here and it will work in this table Finally, we are finding two row. What we already said for this query in our support ticket table. Then it will return this model query. Here is the result. So we can here we can see the assertion the count will be two as we already know and the model instance should be support open tickets. So this is fast. You can see the green check mark let's see another test let's debug here support ticket model and form collection and we already know I already know that 
this will call the real database so we need to mock up this exact same signature and this signature is same and again this signature is exactly same as here and this function is for identity identity code and now we are going this create new ticket action we are passing this support ticket model and this form collection we are already get these two form let's debug we already set this name as user and this is the, the mock-up it will call back here and this model is set to this now now it will call again this call back and here uh, this will add this latest model support ticket to the to this table this fake table and it will redirect to this ticket details page now this is assertion time and you can see this list we are getting four here we are inserted three row and we are inserted last one so this is counting as four and last message should be this message and this is an action result in stance it is redirecting to another action and the route action will be ticket details can see this passing mark one by one pass and one by one pass uh, the zero by one zero by one let's test others action method as well let's run all all passed actually all test of this are passed and you can see now one by one one by one passing everywhere uh, this is unit testing and as I applied fake database and this is also kind of integration testing only for this testing is for controller thank you for watching this video